guys in this video i will show you how you can fix ea app error ec f 10005 so without further ado let's get started uh, first of all what you need to do here you need to run ea app and uh, as you can see here it's connecting uh, we need to wait for a few seconds until the app loads up here and once it it loads up i will show you what you need to do here next so first thing what you need to do here uh, when the app loads up on the top left corner you should see three little lines you need to press on that go to help and go app recovery and clear cache and once you do that <clears throat> then you need to go to on your profile here and log out to your account <clears throat> and you need to log in again and if the problem persists then another mm -hmm. thing that you can do here you need to close completely uh, uh, your e app with the help of the test manager uh, as you can see here uh, first of all close it from your system tree here and then you need to look for uh, tasks here so as you can see here there is uh, no tasks left and once you do that then another thing that you need to do here uh, you need to <clears throat> press windows and i key and then press uh, just write a percentage sign update a percentage sign press ok and you will get this window then you need to go to app data local and you need to delete these uh, three cache folders so uh, first one is ea desktop uh, another one is a <clears throat> lounge helper and another one is electronic arts so delete these folders don't worry about that it's just the cache files uh, basically just what you need to do here after you delete these files is to re-log into your account on ea app <clears throat> and that's pretty much it what you need to do here and uh, if you try this and if the problem persists then you need to go to your ea shortcut here uh, go to open file location uh, right click on ea launcher and go to properties compatibility and make sure to run this program as administrator and if the problem persists then Another thing that you can do here is turn off antivirus, uh, basically programs that you're using, third-party ones like Avast, Kaspersky, or others. Uh, so disable it. And also you need to write a virus and threat protection here. <clears throat> and then um, here on virus and threat protection, you need to press manage settings, uh, turn off real-time protection here. And then you need to scroll down until you see controlled folder access uh, press manage control folder access here and turn that off and then go back on uh, exclusions here and just press add and remove uh, exclusion here press yes and then press add an exclusion folder and then you need to go to your disk where you install the e app usually on your, your disk c program files and then you need to uh, select electronic cards and select the folder like I did this here and once you do that then you need to uh, close this window and then on search just write windows uh, defender firewall and to press on turn windows defender firewall on and off on uh, or off and turn off windows defender firewall and then you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists then another thing that you can do here is to uh, basically change your dns server uh, uh, addresses and to do so on the bottom right corner you should see network uh, uh, basically icon here uh, right click on it go to network and internet settings uh, and then go to advanced network settings uh, more uh, network adapter options uh, right click on it go to properties uh, make sure that uh, protocol version 6 is off here and also then you need to select uh, internet protocol version 4 um, select use the following DNS server addresses and write Google DNS servers on preferred DNS server write 8.8.8.8 .8 and on alternate DNS server write 8.8.4.4 and once you do that you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists, then what you need to do here lastly is to open up your CMD or command prompt and just right click on it, go to run as administrator, uh, press, uh, press yes. And on this line, just write uh, IP on pig slash slash DNS, right? And you should get this 
messenger successfully flushed in as resolve, uh, resolver cache and the problem should be fixed so yeah if i help you out please press like button and subscribe for more take care bye